your name, brother? Jason Roderick. Uh, where are you from, Jason? Um, from all around, really. I mean, really, I was born in Houston, Texas. Uh, Texas. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, was, boy, I was only there. I was only there as an infant, you know, okay. a couple of years, and then my mom. But I lived in Philly most of my life. Okay. My, my brother was born in Miami, Florida. My other brother was born in our Town. Uh huh. Um, we lived in Philly, South Philly. You know what I'm saying? All over. Okay. Really. okay. What age did you come to Philly? Um, I probably came to Philly fairly young, like, uh, like one years old. You know what I'm saying? I was born in Texas. My mom took off. She said, uh, too many guns over there. She said, uh, okay. yeah. Too hectic out there. Yeah, yeah. She thought she went over there for the violence. She said they went over there, and my my uncle got shot in the, uh, in the leg. And then uh -huh. The second day out there, she said, "Fuck that, I'm coming back." All right. And um, was your father in the picture at all? Yeah, yeah. My dad. In the beginning, yeah, my dad was. Yeah, my okay. dad OD to 13. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. No, no, yes, sir. Okay. So, um, did you know that there was an addiction problem with your dad, or did it just? One of those things that they were sort of using behind the scenes. Um, no, everybody used it pretty much out in the open, but we just thought it was a way of life, you know. I mean, we didn't, no one knew it was a problem until so you got older, you know. Okay. Yeah. Um. And how how did that affect you? Uh, I mean, it just made me the only thing I had, I had no fear of drugs. That's what it was, you know. No fear, like you know. Okay. Because I, I knew I I grew up in a house, you know, with both parents was addicts yeah. and. You know, it it wasn't like they were using right in front of me, shooting up in front of me, but I knew what was going on. Yeah. Um, how did that feel when when he passed away? I, so I have a friend that his father died from an overdose also, and I know he there was like a lot of shame when his father passed away because of the way he passed. Did yeah. you feel any of that, like shame or embarrassment or anything well, like that? No, I never really felt that. Uh, okay. No, no, no. Okay, that's good. Um, did you graduate from high school? No, no. What's your, do you have any uh, favorite childhood memories? Um, or what's your best memory from childhood? Uh, I can't really think. Um, I guess I guess hanging out with my friends, I guess. When I, when I, was, when I was young, smoking weed, hanging out with my friends, I think that was one of my best memories, you know? And growing up, I can't think of many. Yeah. All right. Um, did you have any hobbies or play any sports or anything yeah, like yeah, that? Yeah, I played ball. I played ball all the way up to I was 19. Basketball? Being heavy, yeah. Okay. Put ball, every sport, everything. Okay, so you was athletic? Yeah. Alright. Um, at what age did drugs become part of the picture? I think about like, it. Was like, it was like 18, 19. Uh, yeah, I started smoking weed. Okay. And drinking. And at, um, were you going through anything at that time? Like, were you the victim of any type of abuse, domestic abuse, you know, sexual abuse, um, or anything like that? No, I finally, no, no, I finally got a group of friends. Like I said, I moved around a lot, so I didn't know a lot of people. So I finally met a group of people, and and we started smoking and drinking. You know what I'm saying? And that's how we like bonded. I guess you could say. Okay. Yeah, just like a social thing. As yeah, man. Yeah. This and uh, yeah, and I had like a lot of low self-esteem, so drinking and shit really changed. You know? Oh, okay. We so brought that out of me. Yeah. Social. And yeah. Hell yeah. All that stuff. Okay. Um, do you have any idea where, like, having a low self-esteem came from? Uh, yeah. yeah. It's like, uh, growing up, my mom always got high. She smoked crack. Uh, I can remember growing up uh, not having nice clothes and and being because we lived in neighborhoods like not not always worst neighborhoods. Um, so I know I'd be like the bummiest kid, you know, then growing up throughout my whole life, you know. Yeah. Where did you find yourself where drugs became part of, you know, where you first became, uh, first grew a habit or, or started using on a daily basis? Um, I think right as soon as I started picking up, you know, right away, like, boom, you know, uh, started drinking and I realized this is what I wanted to be, this is how I wanted to feel, you know, because I took it all that away, you know. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, right away, yeah. So, where are you living now? Um, I stay from around, I got, a, I got like, a, I maintain a little, uh, like a little room um, uh, in the basement of this house. Uh, I go all around, I just, you know, man, do, do my thing. But I, I can crash, I can just, just, uh, sleep on pieces of couches and shit if I want. Yeah. Right. Um, where'd you stay at last night? Last night, I uh, know where we just walked around pretty much all night. Okay. Is that where you do a lot of the nights? Sometimes when I make making money, like, uh, sometimes it's uh, easier to walk around with, with the things that, you know, we required to sell them in the next day, so that's what we do. So, and how do you make your money? 
uh, a lot of different ways. I uh, a lot of different ways. But, um, but usually I, I work with a lot of these guys on Jewelers Row and shit like that, and they buy things off me. So I say I do clean outs, which I kind of do. I clean things out. Yeah. Um, but I just uh, some and people come to me with things. I acquire things for the low and sell them for low. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. But you know what I'm saying? But more than something. Yeah. All right. And uh, what's your habit like? My habit's not that bad. I've never been a big on, um, on opiates. Uh, I do them. I don't know really why. I just do them um, mostly because um, it's really not that bad. But uh, it's only like a bag, two bags a day, you know. Um, with, with this shit nowadays, you really can't. It's really not opiates, so it's not the same. Um, it's not that bad, but uh, I guess it's bad enough, you know. But what's, I do speed too, though, you know. Okay, that's what I was going to ask. So what's your main choice? Uh, speed probably, you know what I'm saying. I don't do Speed actually got me off crack. I, you know, I was, went bad for smoking crack for years. But um, now I just do speed, so speed probably is my worst doing. Okay. And uh, by speed, you mean meth? Yeah, meth, meth, meth. Okay. Yeah, right, yeah. And uh, how do you use it? Uh, inject it, I shoot it. Okay. So how long does the meth high last? Um, it could last anywhere between, depending on how good it is, uh, 12 hours to like one hour, you know? And how much does that cost you? Um, it probably cost, uh, it can cost whatever I got pretty much, you know what I mean? Like, I mean, uh, if I get an eight ball, it's a little cheaper nowadays, but you get an eight ball for 60 bucks, 70 bucks, I can last all night, you know? Okay. Yeah. But you can always flip it, you know what I'm saying? So it's, a, it's, it's cheap, but it's more cheaper where I'm from, where I'm at now, than it is around here, so I can always make money off it. Okay, and um, have you had any bad experiences here? Oh yeah, man, yeah, man. Like, around here, yeah, yeah, man. Explain a couple to me, please. Um, a couple times I got jumped. I, I made a big couple bad decisions. Uh, you know, where well, just the money was involved. I, you know, then I got jumped. Uh, about I think it was about a week ago. About three guys came up. You know, um, I bought something off them. It wasn't what it was supposed to be. But like a dickhead, you know, I'm, I'm mouthing, you know what I'm saying, I'm talking shit, and I realized that everybody who's with him wasn't with me. Yeah. So by the bang, by that time, they jumped on me, you know what I'm saying? So, by, 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 I got away with my money, but, you know, it was humbling, you know? Yeah. You know? Realize I'm not from around here for real, you know? Yeah, people gotta remember that. Yeah. Exactly. Do you find that with a lot of the people down here that you meet? Yeah, yeah. Uh, a lot of people, they think they're from there. Yeah, a lot of people, they think, you know what I'm saying, they, they've been down here a couple of years, they think they're from here, but they're not, you know what I'm saying, like, just, and a lot of them find out the hard way, you know? Yeah. 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 Um, what's one of the worst things you've seen down here? Um, but besides women getting beat real bad, but, um, the worst thing I've ever heard of was what happened, you know what I'm saying? I, I seen, I seen a, a girl get beat pretty bad the other night, it was pretty bad, and, um, this bull was beating her up, and, and I, these three guys walked over, and I thought they were gonna help her, and they started kicking her ass. And you know, you can't really do nothing. I just turned my head on you, man. Yeah. And walked away. Like, do you know what it was about? No, nah, I don't know. I don't know what it's about. No, I don't. Uh, I don't know. It's probably. Uh, no, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, I'm sure she did something, but. Yeah. Do you uh, have any questions for me? Uh, no. Nah, yeah. What's this about? Um, I, I do interviews with people tr to try to humanize, you know, people, um, the people that society looks down on, you yeah. know, us addicts, people that are homeless, people that have mental health, um, just to humanize us, to let people know that, you know, we might be in a messed up situation, but at the end of the day, we're still humans, we're still good people, Yeah. you know, um, we're not, you know, dirt, we're no, not, yeah, you know, we're, yeah. we're, we're we're just as important as as somebody else. You know? Yeah, let me ask you. Uh, are you the Kansas and Beach Bull? No, 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 no. Alright, no. I. You know what? That just struck my head. You know yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah, no, yeah. not at all. For me, I feel like he he makes fun of addicts. He no, yeah, why? Well, yeah, 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 yeah. I don't think that at all. I'm, I'm you know who he is? Yeah, yeah, you know who he is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, well, a lot of people know who he is, or no, no, right? I think so. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. I didn't never knew. I just went. Yeah, no, nah, he's a white guy. Yeah, is he? Oh, he's man. White guy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that, that makes it. Yeah, that makes yeah. It almost makes it worse for me, for real, for real. Yeah, he just, you know, sort of makes fun of people. Yeah, that, that, and he's, you know, he's also profiting off it, I think, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's you know, fucked over. Doesn't, doesn't do anything. Matter of fact, know. I'd like to know who he was, yeah. For me, I feel like if you come down here yeah. and do any type of recording, anything like that, you have to contribute yeah. to the same. Well, I agree, especially if you're, you know, you know what I'm saying, saying, making something, you're, you're yeah. doing something off it, I agree, I agree. Of, of course, you yeah. know, like, you know, yeah, so I, I just, 
it can't be all take, take, take with anything. No, yeah, yeah, yeah Especially yeah. with this stuff. Yeah, yeah, know? yeah. That's just as bad, man. Motherfuckers don't realize habits are all tasting like money. hundred percent. Listen, we all, we all, we're, we're all just addicted to the different stuff. Yeah, 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 no doubt For about me, it. I'm not getting high right now. Yeah. But I eat fucking chocolate every single night. No, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So it, the, the, it's just, you know, one, one. Yeah, yeah one vice for another. Yeah, that, that's all it is. You know, it's, it's, it's no different. We all just sin differently. No, I understand It just that, so yeah. happens to be that yours is with drugs right now. Mine might be with food, you know. Yeah, yeah, man. It's, it ain't no different. It's, it's the same thing. Yeah. Um, well, I thank you, brother. All and right, I, bro. I hope uh, things progress for you and go whichever way you are uh, trying to make them go. Salute. I thank you. Yeah.